Hello, welcome to Eagle Eye Opener Global Outreach and Brothers and Adidas. I have a message. In fact, this message is very, very serious. It is about a civil war, citizens against citizens fighting in the US. Some time ago, I had a vision. I saw that citizens were rising up against citizens. A civil war broke out in the US. And then on the 27th of December, 2023, I had another vision. The same vision, but this time around, a detailed one. Let me read what I saw. On the 27th of December, I had a vision. I saw a small dark cloud in one part of the United States of America. I saw that it fell to the ground. Some citizens came and picked pieces of the falling dark clouds and ate its pieces. It looks like ice block that is flaky. So I saw this dark cloud, it was small, and then it fell to the ground. Some people I understand to be citizens of the US picked it up and they were eating it. It was flaky. You know how ice block when it is about melting, when assuming, okay, for instance, if you heat it against a wall and then it looks weak and flaky, but it's still, uh, it's still bound together. It's not, it hasn't melted away. That is what I saw that, that is how it looks like. It was flaky. So they picked it and they ate it. After eating it, I heard this voice. Um, I saw that after eating it, they were very, very angry. And then I heard this voice. The voice says, pray that it doesn't spread. Referring to the anger that this anger, these people have now. Pray that it doesn't spread. That means spread to the other parts of the country. Then I heard the voice of the Holy Spirit saying, I will personally come down to quench this turmoil. It is deepened in the hearts of many already. If I don't stop it, it will disrupt the flow of important events. I shall send my Holy One to proclaim peace over the land. Let everyone that loves peace pray for America. So the Lord promises that he is going to stop it. If not, it is going to disrupt major events. I don't know what these major events are, but I believe in my own understanding that there are cause of events that God has endorsed that must take place in this world. So if this world breaks out and it succeeds, then it is going to interrupt these events. Then this night again, I had another vision. Today is 4th January 2024. I heard the Holy Spirit saying to me to warn his people. He said, let everyone who protests do it peacefully. In this case, nothing will be achieved through violence. The same powers who are behind January 6 shall manipulate the crisis to achieve their goals. For those of if you want to protest, uh, meanwhile, no particular thing was actually pointed out why the uh, protest is going to take place or why the civil war is going to break out. But the Lord says, I should warn people that if you go out to protest, protest peacefully, because the powers behind what happened January 6, those powers are going to manipulate the situation to achieve their aims. As a matter of fact, what I saw was that they manipulated it and escalated 
the crisis so that when the crisis grows big and bigger, they will manipulate it to achieve their aims. There are powers in authority who are trying to manipulate situations in order for them to achieve their own goals. So please, we who are Christians, we should pray for the U.S. Pray seriously for the U.S. Uh, I don't know why, but God reveals a lot of things to me about the U.S. Uh, recently, I think that was like three days ago, I saw four vacant seats and they were in front of other seats. They were vacant and the Lord gave me a message and he said, when you see these four seats vacant in the, at the federal level of the U United States government, you will know that I am in charge. This is a sign that I am in charge of this world and that despite the plans of the globalists and the plans of the devil, I am still in charge. Please pray. I remember before the 2020 election, God gave me a message about Adolf Hitler, about rising in the U.S. Okay, let me not talk about that. I'm going to do another video where I'm going to explain how Adolf Hitler actually arose in the U.S. And it's Joe Biden. I, I had another vision some time ago. I saw that Obama's wife uh, proclaimed a new world order. That was some years ago. I can't actually remember when. She proclaimed a new, she proclaimed a new world order. I'm going to do some set of videos and I will kind of bring those videos to um, um, talk about those videos, replay them and you will see the days these videos were actually uh, posted. Uh, there is a comment on my personal YouTube channel, Ozena E. E. Devi, where a lady actually commented on two videos and she said, sir, could you please repost these videos? These things are happening now. Please, a lot of things are happening. The devil is trying to take over the U.S., the government of the U.S., which I also talk about in a video some time ago that Satan is trying to take over the U.S. because he tries to take over the whole world, the government of the whole world. And for him to do that, he needs to overthrow the government of the U.S. I mean infiltrated and weakening the U.S. And for him to take over Africa, he also needs to take over, conquer Nigeria first. This process is actually ongoing. We need to be wise as watchmen. Let us be prayerful. Let us be wise. Let us know that the devil is seriously at work. When we need to resist him, let us resist. When it calls for prayers, let us pray. I have been praying with my prayer partner uh, for about a week now, we've been praying about this uh, revelation that God gave to me of uh, a riot, of a civil war that the devil wants to make cause to break out. Please, let's be prayerful. Please share this video. And in case you have not subscribed, subscribe and click the subscribe the, the bell. Click the bell so that you can receive notification whenever I post any video. Thank you and God bless you. God bless you. Bye-bye.